A seventh game is like an ongoing no-hitter. They're going for all the marbles here tonight in Pittsburgh. Like, ooh, seventh game. The winner of this ball game goes to the World Series, and the loser stays home to watch it on television. My greatest memory of the first seventh game was being in a cab in Pittsburgh. And I get in the front seat, our PR guys got in the back seat, it's a short ride over to the stadium. Three River Stadium and the home of the Pittsburgh Pirates. The cabbie was a diehard Pittsburgh Pirate fan. He asked where we're from, we said Atlanta, and he was like, oh man, wow, that's great. Great run, but it ends tonight. Pirates are gonna make it happen. That Smoltz guy, he's got no chance. King's gonna beat him. Bell's gonna beat him. Like he's going down this list and he doesn't have a clue that he's got this game seven starter sitting in his front seat. And John Smoltz goes to the hill. He was a 15 game winner during the season. We go there, I pay the bill. He, no one says a word. Pitch the game. Smoltz gets his eighth strikeout. John Smoltz has gone to the mound to try to make it a complete game. And to the first baseman, Hunter. And that's it for Atlanta. John Smoltz has pitched Atlanta into the World Series. I can only imagine that cabbie reading the, the paper the next day and understanding what had taken place.